Cardinals coming back out here on offense, and we referenced earlier where they sit right now at 3-3-1 and one with those back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back wins. Now the question, Charles, look, they're still in the rear of the NFC West with that record, but did they have any shot at nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Reggie White picks up his second sack of the afternoon. The Cardinals going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over a minute to go before halftime. And they need to work to at least get some of this yardage back after the sack. Second and 19. Throwing now is Murray. Open man is Kirk. Complete. Now the Cards going to call another timeout. Their second as the stoppage will come with a little under a minute to go in this first half. Throwing is Murray on third down. Oh, now Murray has it stripped. On plays like this where the ball comes free, it's often unusual for the team that lost it to get it back because this is, this is a quarterback. The ball gets away from him. Everyone else is trying to execute what they're supposed to do on offense. They're usually looking in the other direction, downfield, or have moved away from him. In this case, though, a teammate is able to come up with the ball. Here's Andy Lee now as the drive goes backwards, so he's on to punt it away. He's been a busy man here in this first half as he gets it away. And Sanders now to return. And how about this? He takes it all the way back. No time, no flags, a punt return touchdown and a stunning end of the first half. And they kicked it to him. They kicked it to him. Well, if you're into cheesy movies, you would title this one a half to remember, wouldn't you? His second return touchdown of the game. What if I'm not into cheesy movies? Well, go ahead and get into it, man, because I just did it, and you're going to green light that one. <laughs> How about those returns? Maybe they ought to think about not kicking him Yeah, the they might, might want to go away from him in the future. Tucker with the extra point. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. Okay, right, Brandon. Thanks very much. And welcome in, everyone, to this slimmed-down version of the EA Sports Halftime Report. This one, maybe not the hard-fought battle many had hoped for. This has been blowout city thus far, but still more football to be played. Who knows what could happen as we send you right back out to Brandon God. And we welcome you back now alongside Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gunn getting set for quarter number three here. So here we go for half number two. The Patriots with the lead, and they will be getting the football. And he'll get across the 20 before he's brought down at about the 23-yard line. Now here's the signal caller getting ready to lead this offense again. And maybe he's starting to wave the white flag a little bit. He's playing pretty well, but the pressure, it's got to it. Has to find a way to step around it, step through it, or just handle it. Because as you mentioned, he's having a pretty good day overall. Just the hits keep coming and taking those sacks. That's not the way that they want to finish a ball game with their quarterback on the ground so much. Uh, he'd like to stay upright. When he's been upright, he's been pretty good. Ready, go. And they start the second half with Johnson. Try to find a lane, but instead he'll get back to the line of scrimmage and no more. The 